Hi there, welcome back to another Sims gameplay channel, or welcome here if it's your first time around town. I am working on the differences in the Family Tree Legacy Challenge. Generation 2 is proving to be like the longest generation ever, but I'm um, powering through. I really want to get on to Generation 3, and I really do want to be successful at a legacy challenge so I'm gonna stick with it I have a few more objectives for Logan's generation I don't need to really start working on generation 3 until Tina ages up to a teenager so according to the calendar that should be next week so I may just play through and just pop in if anything notable happens and see if we can speed our way on to generation 3 this generation is dragging so much, but I'm hanging in. In fact, Logan is about to meet the goal of $50,000 in the household funds before she dies. Which is great because I think her birthday's in like two days, maybe one day? Yeah, her birthday's on Monday. I think I might have her go over to that place in Evergreen Harbor to do some dumpster diving. I got a little bit carried away and I was planning a birthday party for Logan that I wanted to have later, but I forgot to set the time. And so now everyone's coming over for a birthday party at 5.45 in the morning. So, that's where we are. <laughs> I like their dances birthday party before school never hurt anybody all right I'm gonna have her blow out the candle oh here she goes she's gonna age up to elder wrinkled bellies and frosty locks oh she's so cute I'll probably give her a makeover but happy birthday Logan she hasn't quite made it to the 50 grand yet, but I think that's quickly coming up. And I think her birthday party was a success. Logan just got back from work. She has reached the goal of achieving $50,000 in the family funds. So I'm going to cross that off the list. She made some progress with the charisma skill, almost up to level eight. A little bit of work left to do on that. I got it to move a little bit, I guess. And I mentioned previously that I literally wrote down all of the community lots, with the exception of like the vacation homes and stuff, or the vacation areas and stuff. So, of the ones I wrote down, there are 72 that she has to play for tips at, and she has played for tips at 35. And for those of you wondering, that's 48%, almost 49%. So she is doing great with that objective. And that's it. The only other one she needs to do is finish her aspiration, get to level 10 charisma, and play for tips. And again, that, that play for tips is optional. So I don't have to finish that, but it is something I would like to. Next time, Tina is definitely aging up. Her birthday is today so in the next session she's gonna age up I am gonna end this session here just so I can start fresh on her birthday of going through the generation 3 story and the objectives that Tina will have as she ages up but I am so excited to be nearly finished with generation 2 show woo it feels like it's been lasting forever we've got big things big plans things are moving along finally thanks for hanging out with me in this legacy challenge and hopefully cheering me on i will see you next time